What is happening, my dudes? I'm Tythonus, and welcome back to Kingdom of Amalar. So, last episode we left off, we were doing some side quests here in Dighton Hill. And, uh, yeah. So we're gonna keep, uh, keep on chugging through here. I think what we're gonna do is try to do this, uh, the, the plague shield, because we've got one more to get, and it's down here. So I think we're just gonna head that direction and see if we can get that to finish this plague shield, um, quest Good that guy. we have. Good day. Okay, so we need to go around this way. These trees are huge, by the way. They're just giant trees. Did I listen to this one already? Yes, I did that one already. Okay. Hmm. Oh, there's a jump down spot there. Going the right way? Yes, we are. Very good. Run, beware. What is this? Oh, plague shield. Oh, there's stuff up here. What is this stuff? Sage crafter? Tharu's protection. Bunch of stuff out here. What's this one? St. Hadwin's mission. Oh, okay. Gentlemen. Brother Udo? Odo? Udo? By Matharu, I am growing worried for Brother Felon. The day is come and gone, and he still has not returned. He was killed in the forest. Killed? Oh dear. Well, he is with Matharu now. I hesitate to ask, but did you happen to take his prayer beads? Terrible if they were left to lie there with him. Are these his prayer beats? Why, yes, they are. And so he is dead then? Well, he has joined Bitharu. You should know we have a tradition. Rather than bury prayer beads, they are passed on to some other believer. Tell me, do you adhere to Mitharu's creed? <laughs> uh... No, oh, what's the creed? To honor and uphold the forces of order and good. Our religious mission is to see chaos and suffering laid low beneath Mitharu's hammer. Mm, you'll just take my word for it. You have acted well and honorably thus far. It would be wrong of me to distrust you now. Fair enough. I knew I saw the good in your eyes. Eyes never do lie. Keep the beads and do as I tell you. At each mission, Odwigs, Idrix, and our own, there is a special shrine to Mitharu. Go you and pray at each one, and the power of Mitharu will grant your beads great and greater strength. All right. What about the yes, plague? Yes, we have heard of the sad affliction that has struck Titan Hill. Thus it is when nature strays from order. Goodbye. May Tharo watch and guide you always. Okay. So. We've got to, uh. Pray at these shrines of Matharu. And it is Dighton Hill. See? I was saying it right. Okay, so there's that one. Oh, wait. Or is it this one? They look exactly the same. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. So let's start heading back towards Dighton Hill. Hmm. 
Can we? No. Okay. Alrighty. Uh, let's just head back down that way. It's not too far away. Yeah, there we go. Almost there. A yeah, pretty quick, uh, quick and easy quest there. Not too much going on. I thought it was going to be a little bit more involved. But that's alright. Sometimes the short and uh, simple ones are nice. You're welcome in Diden Hill. Always. I'm welcome. I'm welcome always. Yes. Always welcome. You hear that? I think that's yeah. The healer's cottage is who I'm giving this plague shield stuff to. There she is. That's all the plague shield then. We have enough to last for a while yet, at any rate. Please, have this as thanks. Well, thank you. Healing. <gasps> Lift curse. Yes. Lift the curse. Nice. Well, on your way with you. Oh, and now I have curse immunity. Cool. Right on. I want some crazy magic in the background there. Okay, so... Brother Brothers Till's books. Orden's Bridge. Got stuff way over there. So let's, let's go this direction. There. Despite the plague. Old home mill house. <clears throat> Alright, let's head this direction. And cover some more of this side of the map here. Murderer's Hold. That sounds like someplace I maybe don't want to go. It's a little scary sounding, honestly. Hey, what? Just what do you think you're doing poking around this jail? Trust me. We've got enough troubles with the blood plague and all that. We don't go tossing people in there unless we've got to. Okay. Well, then I will... Can I go... Can I go in? No, I cannot go in. I feel like if I try to unlock that, that guy's gonna get mad at me too. Let's recover these books while we're over here. Little cottage here. Little cottage out out near the lake. So where is the So Brother oh. Fallon is dead? And I thought things were bad as they could get. This means Astrid will run out of plague shield sooner or later. I'm able to supply it. The village has not always been kind to me, but never mind that. This will be my olive branch. Fate Weaver. Okay, so this this will let me reset my uh, skills that I've uh, chosen so far. Farewell. Farewell. Up above, I think. Is that where the book is at? I'm guessing, yeah. There we go. <clears throat> Excuse me. And out we go. <laughs> Alright, so from here... Acquire the daggers, locate the former contract holder. We'll just keep going this down this way. There's quite a bit to explore down here. Oh, it's a brownie. Got 
Boggart, man. Easy there, killer. Gotcha. Okay. Moving on. Why do they have all this gold? Maybe from killing, like, travelers or something. Wait, how do I? Oh, maybe that that way over there. Huh. Okay. Iron hold passage. Should we do it? Yeah, let's do it. Iron hold passage, huh? What do we have in here? That startled me. Oh, that broke right away. Oh, that broke right away. That broke. Oh, there we go. Come on. Yeah. Almost had it. There we go. Prismere lockpick? What is that? Any pickable lock, regardless of the wielder's skill. Ooh, that sounds good. Staff of the Dusk. Oh, ooh, kobolds. Ooh. These are tough. He's running away. That was funny. He just started running away from us. I, I feel like I just have to break all the chat, uh, like crates when I see him. I can't help myself. Wish we could help ahead. Gotcha. Go home. How they say that? It sounds like they actually might be the ones who are at home and I'm kind of invading, so. Okay. Very echoey in here. Yolven. Oh. This must be the other side then here. Oh, okay. Ah. Oh. oh. Scared the crap out of me. That is disgusting. No. Get out of here with that giant spider. That's gross. Burn it. Kill it with fire. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that thing. Yuck. That was startling. I was not prepared. Especially coming up out of the ground like that. Bones of a silk farmer that died at the hands of some spiders. I should see if we can give them to a respectful burial somewhere in a nearby town of Kenarok. 
Take the remains. All right. These books are everywhere. This is the... Oh, yeah, here. Where's this? Canarock. Oh, this is Canarock. Whoa. <clears throat> Listen, you guys can't be popping up out of the ground like that. It's freaking frightening. No, no, no. You leave that guy alone. Get out of here. Ouch. NPCs die in this game, like by uh, enemies. I have no idea. I'm hoping not. Back off. Giant spiders are a no-no. Yeah, get out of here. Thank the gods, somebody, somebody finally came. Tell us, are you from Goreheart or Dyden Hill? How many warriors travel with you? It seems you're not the assistance we requested, but don't think me ungrateful. I could, uh, Canarok could use someone of your particular skill. What happened to this town? We sit on the border to Webwood. Most of us silk farmers. Normally, we rely on our bridges and an ancient summer fay aura to guard us. But of late, what defenses we have are failing. These monstrous spiders strike at us from all sides. They've even gotten as far as Yolven. A week ago, a team of hunters was led by the village's chief defender, Barton. We need someone to go find him and his party. I'll find him for you. Good. I have more information to give you regarding Barton and the hunting party. But let's not give anyone false hope. And these townsfolk are growing hysterical. Meet me on the southern bridge and we'll continue our discussion. Very well. Good hunting. Good hunting. Abandoned house. What, is it? what all we got in here? It's only stuff I can loot and steal, I guess. Stranger. Looks like the wrong place at the wrong time, like me. No offense, but I've not much interest in talking or listening. Doesn't pay to get too comfortable with people in this town right now. Why are you wanting to know about him? I don't go asking you about yourself. You could return the favor. Survival is my concern, not who leads Kenarok. He's human, and all that entails. Nasty place. I'd get as far away from it as I could. Do you go talking to all strangers, asking about their lives and who they are? Leave me alone. <laughs> Finally. Oh, okay. He seems a little suspicious up here. Just a little bit. A little odd. <laughs> But hey, maybe it's just because he's living in a town that's overrun with spiders. I don't know. Could be me. Could be me. All right, what else we got in here? Gossamer's End. Warner House. Hmm. lab uh okay there's not really much in here is there oh why are you people sleeping on the floor your bed's right there 
Thank the gods. Someone from the outside finally made it through. I thought we'd be... Uh, well, I never thought I'd see a new face again. But it's good you're here. I'm Siloretta Vonner, the village mediciner. And I need your help. What do you need from me? Normally, I keep a stock of anti-venom at hand for when silk farmers get bitten, but with the recent attacks, my stores have been emptied. There's not much to the potion, but because we've been in Webwood for so long, we are more sensitive to the spider poison than most. So there is an ingredient I still need. The poison glands of the spiders themselves. I'll need someone to harvest them. I'll get them for you. Good. I'll need as large a batch of the potion as I can make, so 15 glands or so will be needed. Goodbye. Good day. You came from the wood? I, I, I almost can't believe the last time I was in there. It was when the spiders first came. Sorry, I forget myself. I'm Jennery Vorna. I gather reagents for my wife, Silretta, Canarok's mediciner. A widow? It was something that my old dad used to tell me when he wanted to scare the daylights out of me. Watch you don't go too close to the webs, Jen, he'd say. The widow will have your eyes for supper. I always thought it was just a tale. Yeah, I'm going to say not. Find the web. Okay, but seriously, why are you not sleeping in the bed? I have no idea. Maybe it's like the, you know, they're afraid of getting bed, bed bugs or something. <laughs> I mean, they're overrun with spiders, so bed bugs could be a problem here. Who knows? This is a silken seat. Oh, they've got, like, defenses set up in here. Uh, blacksmithing forge. What else? There? There's, there's like nothing going on in here. Stranger, I heard you aren't afraid to pass through Webwood. <sighs> what I wouldn't give to be like you, to leave this place. I haven't seen my home in weeks, and I fear something horrible has happened there. What's happened at your home? That's just it. I don't know. I came to Canarok some days before the first attacks. I was stuck here. Our farmhand, Cartery Jake, stumbled into Canarok a few days later. He was tight-lipped about my parents at first. Then he said the spiders got them. Now he avoids me, avoids everyone. Something happened at the farm, but I can't bring myself to find out what. I'll go. Thank you. I, I will give you whatever I have. Just bring me news of my mother and father. I need to know what happened there. Farewell. Okay. Grim Harvest. Why are these people laying on the floor? There's a lot I need to do, stranger. So if you've come on business, you should make it quick. The forge is hot if you need to use it, and I have a few items I can spare, but we'll need them soon enough, I'm sure. Stay alert. He's very busy, mind you. Look, he's so busy right now. See how busy he was? Everybody in this world needs to sleep. Except for me, apparently. I don't need sleep. Sleep is for the weak. Does no one else see the widow? The widow is coming for us, and her brood comes with her. We'll be food before nightfall. We can't hold this island, these few buildings against them. Okay. Do you have anything? Can I buy anything from you? Hmm. Liquid seduction. Oh wait, um sell those. 
<laughs> right, force potion, lightning storm. I don't know what most of these things are. Oh, that's all my Beware the material. forest. Beware the forest. Oh, I can use this bed. I'll sleep. Give me a nice eight hours of sleep. I have used the bed. I'm just like them now. This is why I need like a little house. We're all awake. All that, just, just to know that it's behind there. Behind there is a locked chest that I can't unlock without doing a bad thing. So, oh well. Okay, so where are we? Okay, so we've got... Father Till's books are in that area over there. Find the other remains. There's a bunch over there. Alright, well, I think before we head out there and start doing some more of these side quests we're gonna stop here and the next one we'll just pick up here at can rock and continue on so with that if you enjoy this episode don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and share and hit that bell to get notified of whenever new episodes are out and as always i will catch you in the next video i'll see ya